What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Um, hopefully, you can hear me okay. There's a couple people said they couldn't hear me earlier, so I'm trying to make sure you guys can hear me okay, okay? Let me get comfortable real quick. Okay. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take your messages. Resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. I have personal readings currently open. There's two offerings. There's a full reading and a mini reading. Um, if you are interested, you have to text me to book. All the information's in the description box below, okay? All right, so. Hey, buddy, there's food in there. There's food in there. Come on. Just so anyway, so, okay. So I, y'all know I don't get smells very often. I don't, but I got the channeling and then I sat down and was just chilling for a minute before I put the camera on and put my stuff in the description box and all that. And I got two smells. Um, so I think they're significant to this reading. Okay, so the first smell I got was a musty smell, which my house is not musty. It smells of many things a lot of times. Feet and food and cat litter smell sometimes, um, but not musty. I smelled musty. It was about 30 seconds, and then it went away. So I was just sitting here like, what? what why? Why am I smelling that? Um, but, you know, that is part of the Claire's. That's part of the Claire's smell. And I got a smell when, in a reading... It was about a month ago, and y'all know it's very, like, uh, two years ago, I got a spaghetti smell or something, then I didn't get any. Then I got the one about a month ago. So this time I got musty smell right before I clicked the camera on, after I got the clear audience uh, message. Then, about 45 seconds to a minute after that, I got a very heavy perfume smell. Like, very heavy. Like, knock your lights out perfume smell. And I'm just being for real. Like, whoever, and I don't wear perfume. If I do, it's like Bath and Body Works. It's like very light, very airy. No, this is like somebody meant to slather this crap on, and they did it for a reason. And it was very strong, and it was not cologne. It was feminine, perfume as type stuff. So I don't know. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, but a musty smell for about 30 seconds and very heavy femme perfume as type smell that will like knock your socks off if you, whoever you were around had this perfume on. It was that strong and it was, it happened for about 30 seconds then it went away. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay. All right. So the channel message I received was a water sign grandparent. Um, Cancer Pisces Scorpio grandparent is about to ever, um, oh, put down. I'm sorry, they're scratching. They look, I don't know why he's doing that. I filled up his food bowl or, earlier. He's still scratching at the back. Hey, come here, buddy. Come on. That could be confirmation for somebody possibly. Come on. But probably not because he does that a lot. I'm just saying. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. Come over here. Come on. Okay. So the channel message I received was um, a water sign grandparent um, is about to ever regret choosing, um, uh, I heard a, a water sign baby mama and baby daddy um, to be a part of their life. Um, I heard this person is about to become more of a hindrance than a help and it's about to happen quickly. I heard in one of these situations, um, the baby mama and the ba or the baby daddy because it was two baby mama and baby daddy in here water sign baby mama baby daddy heavy water sign energy i just want to add cancer pisces scorpio grandparent energy and then we have a cancer pisces scorpio baby mama cancer pisces scorpio baby daddy so all water signs through many series of chain events these people are about to become more hindrances than helps i think to the uh grandparents there are several situations in here, at least two. But in one of these situations, through many series of chain of events, 
one of the a police the police will be called in one of these situations because I heard the baby mama is about to get so disrespectful to one of the grandparents that it's about to cause the police to be called and many series of chain events. I heard in one of these situations they might end up in jail because it's about to get that bad. So you plug it in how it resonates. My God Almighty. I wonder if it's going to be, I didn't hear any of this, but I wonder if it's going to be like domestic violence or something like that. I mean, it's going to be so bad that I feel one of these people are going to feel threatened or there's a real reason they need to call the police. Um, however that resonates, okay? Heavy Cancer Pisces Scorpio energy, Cancer Pisces Scorpio grandparent, Cancer Pisces Scorpio baby mama, Cancer Pisces Scorpio uh, baby daddy. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, you guys. All right, let's pull some cards. In one of these situations, it's about to be about money. About to have a serious argument about money. A very serious argument. And one of these baby mamas and baby daddies will get so angry, they will probably throw something in the grandparents' home and break it. Shatter. <clears throat> it's going to cause the police to be called. Damaged property. Oh, my God Almighty. So that's probably why the police is going to get called. Okay. Well, I heard police was going to get called in one of these situations. Well, that would make sense. So one of these situations, there's going to be an argument over money. Money in some shape, form, or fashion with baby mama or baby daddy. Her specifically is baby mama. Baby mama is going to get so upset that uh, over some kind of argument over money in some shape, form, or fashion that I heard it sounds like she is going to be in the grandparents' home when this occurs. Uh, the water sign grandparents' home that she's going to get so angry that I heard she's going to pick up, it sounds like some an item in the grandparents' home and throw it in. I heard shatter. It's going to shatter. And that's. It sounds like that's how the police is going to get called for a destruction of property in the grandparents' home. It sounds like it's going to take place in the grandparents' home, and it sounds like it hasn't happened yet. Holy shit a moly. That is so disrespectful. I just want to throw that out there. That's so disrespectful. I would never think about, I have never, would never do that. Of course, I'm, I'm not a baby mom and baby daddy. I'm an ex-wife, but... I've been in my um, ex-husband's parents' house many times. I There's nothing in there I'd want to steal. And this ain't about theft. But I sure as hell wouldn't have picked up anything and just like threw it. Um, that's, that's disrespectful. People are taught manners. And that's just the truth. What the hell? She is going to get so angry. It's going to turn into a huge thing. More than one item might get broken. And she probably will end up in jail. And lose her job. Oh my God, I'm only. For one, for one, one doesn't have a job. Oh my God. So there's two baby mamas. There's two. One has a job. One does not have a job. And oh my God. And I heard, uh, so the arguments can be over money. There's two baby mamas. One has a job. One, one doesn't. Going to be throwing shit in the grandparents' house. And police will get called. And in one of these situations, it sounds like the one with the job and the one with not job will probably get sent, uh, carted off by the police for destruction of property in the grandparents' house, as they should. Absolutely. And the one with the job will probably end up losing their job probably because they'll end up asking going to be in jail. I don't know if they'll be able to bond out or bail out or not. I don't know. Man, that's some shit. I would have never thought about doing that. That, of course, me and the ex-husband's parents don't talk about money. Uh, there's no reason to. I, I don't know. This is weird. This is weird. It's about to turn into a huge thing. Someone's getting a huge wake-up call. It's about to turn into a huge thing, and someone's about to get a huge wake-up call. So, 
You plug it in how it resonates. So this argument over money in the grandparents' house is about to turn into a huge thing and someone's getting a huge wake-up call. So maybe it's the grandparents getting a huge wake-up call. Maybe I, maybe one of the grandparents watches this uh, my readings. Oh my God, you can't make this crap up. Or maybe the baby mom or baby daddy watches my readings. You plug it in how it resonates. But however that resonates, this this person, these people are very immature. I'm pulling in the baby mamas very strong. Baby daddies, I, hopefully they're not out there throwing shit. But the baby mamas, I'm pulling them in very strong. Just saying, just saying. We have hostilities. You can't make this crap up even if you wanted to. With caring connections, um, number 26 or 14 can be very significant numbers in one's life. Number 26 or 14. That's why I just stay to my damn self, man. Always have me and my kids. And, the, uh, you know, I pull in stories like this of people acting damn fool and disrespecting their um, disrespecting their exes uh, and baby mama and baby daddy's parents and all of this, that, and the other. I don't do that shit. I say to myself, but yet my kids aren't here. And that's just the truth. Where's the justice in that? Not. Hostilities. Severe aggression from these baby mamas. Severe. In one of these situations, there might be a domestic violence situation. Possibly on one of the grandparents. Oh my God Almighty. This is terrible. This is terrible. I, I, I would never think about putting hands on my ex-husband's uh, parents. What is going on here? Oh, my God. I heard in one of these situations, um, one of the baby mamas might end up putting hands on one of the grandparents. So, domestic violence. Hostilities. You cannot make this up. One, they're going to be throwing shit in the grandparents' house. Grow up. One, they're going to might put hands on the grandparents. Grow up. If the baby mamas watch, grow up, man, grow up. If you need to hear that. This is, did not, your parents not teach you how to respect others? Just saying, just saying, this is terrible. So five, uh, five of wands here, hostilities, damn. Caring connections. <clears throat> This is about to wake the grandparents up in a huge way. A huge way. Once these situations occur. It's about to cause them to speak on a, on a situation. Connecting with an important person. Speaking on a, a very important situation regarding the baby mamas. A different situation. Of the past. Balancing. It's going, it's going to balance the scales. Okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. Damn, this is this is terrible. I, I can feel the hostile energy in here. This, I, I would never dream of doing that shit. Never. Never. I mean, this is terrible. But I heard the grandparents are going to realize they pick they pick wrong. So who I mean, yeah, I would say so. But whoever this is for, um, the grandparents are going to have a huge wake up call after the throwing shit occurs, destruction of property in their home, or the hands get put on them from the baby mamas. Now I pulled in baby daddy energy in here earlier, but I'm not pulling in the hostile baby daddy. I'm pulling in the hostile baby mama in um, situations, and that's just the truth. Uh, now, with the the baby daddy, it doesn't sound like they're going hostile, but the baby mamas are, and I'm just being for real. But I heard it's going to wake these grandparents up and um, 
whoever the grand water sign grandparents are and uh, realize they picked wrong. And I heard it's going to cause them to contact a very important person and have them speak on a very important situation of the past after all this destruction of property in their home occurs or the domestic violence situation against them uh, occurs, I'm presuming. And the police get involved. And one of, uh, it sounds like uh, hopefully both of their ass get sent to jail, but I heard one of them's going to lose their job over this. One works and one don't. Um, I, I think the caring connections in this situation is they realize, I heard it's going to cause them to speak on a very serious situation in the past of some kind of wrongdoing the baby mamas did in the past regarding another situation. So I think they care about this situation in the past and maybe they were afraid to speak on it in the past or they didn't do the right thing in the past or what have you, what have you. I'm not sure. Grandparents, I feel you might watch, and that's why I am pulling you in. Maybe baby mamas, you might watch. That's why I'm pulling you in. Baby daddies, I'm not picking up any hostile energy. Thank God. Just saying. But however that resonates, it's going to cause the grandparents to speak up. Uh, why they didn't do it in the past, I don't know. I'm a big believer in action. Big believer. But I don't know why they didn't. I don't know. Only you know, grandparents, why you didn't speak up in the past. But it sounds like once your shit gets destroyed or you get hands put on you by some kind of hostile baby mama energy, it's going to cause you to speak up. Um, just saying, just saying. It's going to cause you to take action. This is crazy. It's going to cause you to speak up in a huge way. Some of these uh, water sign grandparents are already having mental health issues over not speaking up in the past. Okay. So, grandparents, if this resonates for you, I heard it's going to cause you to speak up in a huge way. And some of you guys are already having mental health issues because of the past. So, I think the baby mamas manipulated you in some shape, form, or fashion in the past. Huge manipulation. Huge. Huge manipulation in the past, huge. So it's going to cause you to take action. But I, I mean, it's going to be after your crap gets destroyed by them, by them throwing crap in your home or them putting hands on you. I don't promote any kind of physical violence or destruction of property or anything like that. That is, this is something. This is terrible. Um, but it's good that you're going to take action on some kind of situation in the past that you didn't speak up with in the past, but you're about to. Um, because you care. Um, or you care now because your crap's getting destroyed or um, your hands got put on you. Uh, but I heard it was the baby mama that manipulated uh, basically you not to speak up in the past. Um, the baby mama and, and the son. The baby mama and the son. The baby mama and the son manipulated you not to speak up in the past. Grandparents. So the baby mama and the son manipulated you not to speak up in the past, but you're about to speak up once the shit hits the fan in your home or on you. I mean, that's not funny. It's not funny. I'm not laughing if somebody gets hit. I'm really not. I'm really not. That. I'm really not. That's terrible. And I'm sorry. Really, really, I am. I do not laugh about that. I don't promote any kind of violence, any. But, okay, I don't. I'm sorry, I shouldn't laugh. But my point is, is it's good that you're going to speak up. It's sad that your, your shit's about to get broken or you're about to get hit for you to speak up, but you are about to speak up. So good. I heard your son manipulated you not to speak up in the past and the baby mama, but you're about to do it because you're about to see some crazy baby mama action, baby. It's about to get wild. You're about to see a whole new side of this person, baby mama. Oh my God, a moly. Holy shit, a moly. I heard it's about to get wild. You're about to see a whole new side of this baby mama. I, I Like I said, I pulled in the baby daddy energy earlier, but he's not the one going buck. It's the baby mama. Water sign grandparents. I heard you're about to see a whole new side of her. A whole new side. It is about to scare the hell out of you. She's not who you thought she was, and she never was. Oh, my God. Whoa. Maybe she's bipolar? I didn't hear she was, but damn. 
I heard it's about to scare the hell out of you. You uh, about to see a whole new side of her. Um, and you're not going to like it. And you're not going to like it. A whole new side of her and you're not going to like it. Um, yikes. And I think that's what's about to cause you to take some action. But it was the son that manipulated you. The son and her manipulated you in the past not to speak up. But you're about to. But it's because you're about to see a whole new side of her ass. You speaking up is about to really, 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 really help the situation in a huge way. A situation that should have been balanced in the past, but huge cover-up energy. Okay, I heard you speaking up is about to help balance a huge situation in the past, but it wasn't ever balanced because of huge cover-up energy. Whoever you are, grandparents, um, but none of this has happened yet. The throw-in of the destruction of items in your home hasn't happened yet or hitting of you. In your home hasn't happened yet or on your property um and i'm whoever is about to get hit um or kicked or scratched or bit or whatever she it's not funny it's really not funny but damn i mean i'm just thinking about this what how old is this person like this is terrible but whatever is she's about to do to cause some kind of domestic violence on one of you guys it's not funny, but what is going on with people? <laughs> like, I, I just, I, I would never fathom to do that to anybody, especially my ex-husband's parents. Like, what? But whatever this is, I, I heard basically it's about to, um, whatever she does to you, whether she hits you or kicks you or bites you or scratches you or whatever i heard you, the a whole other side's about to come out to her you're you're gonna hate it basically um it's about to wake your ass up just saying y'all i'm gonna have this i heard it's gonna make the situation move fast once you speak up i just want to reiterate that so it's action it's gonna make the situation move fast once you speak up okay Ooh. B E S J B E S J R P B E S J R P M and M B E S J R E B E S J R P M is what I heard. B is in Baker, E is in Egg, R is in Rabbit, S is in Sunshine, J is in uh, Jack o' Lantern, uh, P P is in Pumpkin. Oh my God! And M and M is in Money. So you plug it in how it resonates. That could be first, middle, last initial of you, uh, your name or a nickname of you or this baby mama. I mean, I pulled him in earlier, but really we're talking about baby mamas. So you plug it in how it resonates. K A K and A and K and A and C and C K A and C. So K A and C too. K is in kite. A is in apple. C is in cat. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. That could be first, middle, last initial, or nickname initial of you, grandparents, water sign grandparents, or the baby mama I'm feeling, or somebody else. You plug it in how it resonates, but somehow these initials are significant. I'm getting out of this. I love you guys. Namaste.